Hey, what's up guys? This is Tony from Tony Tutorials. Uh, today I'm actually going to show you all how to modify your main menu block over here. Um, I know a lot of people are like, well when I download this I don't want to have all these links on my site. Like I want to be able to take out like if I don't want supporters or survey or if you don't want the news on there or whatnot. So I'm actually going to show you all how to activate and deactivate the links that only you want. <clears throat> Excuse me. So, uh, so what you want to do is you want to log into your site as your admin, get to your admin panel. Once you're in there, you actually want to go with modules. Okay. Once you get into modules, you want to go to modules block edit, which is this right here as you see you pretty much see everything like it is up here your home well you can't well, sorry you can't change your home you can change the picture you just can't actually take that module out but for instance members it has profile your account private messages etc members same thing here so the things I don't really ever use is I don't ever use the content the docs um, FAQs I will set up later but since it's not set up right now I'm going to deactivate it. Feedback um, I'm going to leave it on this site just because it's my tutorial site and if you want to leave feedback that would be nice. Recommend us I'm going to leave that simply just because people want to recommend my tutorial site to other people and they can just do that. Uh, stories archive I'm going to Deactivate that site map. Really, no need for that. Donations. I'm gonna keep that up there. Just simply because if somebody wants to help out with um, keeping the site up and running, and for the time I use to make these videos, if people want to give a little donation. That's always greatly appreciated, but it's not a must, so don't have to worry about it. The news. Um, that's pretty much if you like use the new stuff to um, post news up on your site about new things coming out or new stuff happening on the website uh, basically it depends on what kind of site you're building since this is a tutorial site I'm going to leave um, news active um, downloads I'm going to leave active web links because um, I'm going to have some links on my site to other sites so I'm going to leave that active so statistics I don't ever use those um, surveys, uh, I don't feel like the supporters, no. Alright, so pretty much everything in pink, that's what's going to be deactivated. So let me click submit. And as you can see here, the list has gotten a lot shorter. But now I'm actually going to take some stuff. I said, so this stuff being in the, in the other, I'm going to move it to the community. So this other will be gone. Um, simply, all you gotta do is go to other and then click and drag it. So, like this, I'm gonna click and drag it up to community. Same thing would recommend us. It's gonna come up in the community also. Same thing about feedback. It's gonna come up in here. And then I'm going to click submit. As you can see, the others is gone, but now my community, I have my download, I'm going to talk my donations, recommend us, and feedback. And that's how you can change that around. Uh, I hope this tutorial helped y'all out. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel, and also visit um, my website here. Um, it's coming up and running, just not a couple more days, I should be done. Uh, anyways, it's TonyTuts.x10hosting.com. Um, Come and check me out. All my videos will be there, and I got form support also. So uh, just check me out. All right, thanks for watching.